How'd the meeting go? Mm, what was that, honey? Did the meeting go well? Sarah. Mm. Sarah. Why are you yelling? I'm literally right here. You know the rules. No phones at the table. What's the big deal? It's 2021. Everyone uses their phone while they eat. Not in this household, they don't. You're so annoying. Excuse me? Come on, just put it down for 10 minutes, sweetheart. This is family time. Yeah, family time with a family that I don't want to be a part of. Where are you going? If I can't use my phone at the table, then I won't eat. Simple as that. <sighs> okay. I don't, I don't know. Mom? Uh, give me a second. I thought you weren't talking to me. I'm not. Uh, but I need $40. For what? Okay, for something. I, I just need it. But didn't you get your allowance on Monday? Did you already spend it? Well, I've only got 20 bucks left, but that's it. You do realize my $100 allowance isn't a lot of money, right? I mean, all my friends get way more than that. And there are a lot of people who don't get anything, okay? So I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to wait. But mom, I- Sarah, I am not gonna change my mind. Whatever. Honey, my sister's on the phone. She wants to say hello. Oh, how nice. Uh, hello? <laughs> yeah, hi, Cindy. It's five o'clock. Wanna watch the new Darman video? Hmm, I'll watch it later. Well, we won't be taking the test today. Because the three of us have a basketball game. What do you mean? The game's tomorrow. Not according to the uh, photos, not? Hey, Dad. Yes, honey. Can I have $40? Uh, did you ask your mom? Uh, no, yeah, yeah, uh, she was about to give it to me before you came down. Oh, okay, then yeah. Here you go. Thanks, Dad, you're the best. Yeah. Why did you just give that to her? What do you mean? She said you were about to give it to her. I, I cannot believe you just lied. Give that money back to your father right now. I wouldn't have to if you guys weren't so mean to me. We're not trying to be mean to you, but the work- I don't want another dumb lecture, okay? Go into my room. Oh, come on, Sarah. Sarah! See you guys later. Hang out. Hey, hey, hey. I, I, I... Where do you think you're going? To hang out with Ashley and Morgan? On a Thursday night. I don't think so. You know you're not allowed to go out on weekdays. I don't have school tomorrow, so technically it's more like a weekend. Sorry, you're not going anywhere, honey. You can see your friends tomorrow night. What? No, my friends are already waiting for me. I have to go. Were you gonna say something, Jeff? I'm sorry, sweetheart, but you know the rules. Ugh, I'm so sick of all your guys' rules. Well, as long as you live under this roof, you're gonna have to follow them. Well, maybe I won't live in this house anymore. How about that? Sarah! I'm serious. One day you guys are gonna wake up, and I'm gonna be gone. Just watch. Thank you.
$17 for this top was such a good deal. You should have bought the jeans too. I tried to ask my parents for my money and they wouldn't give it to me. They're so strict. They wouldn't even let me come here. That's why I had to run away. I thought about running away before too, but I can never do it. Same. I never made it past the driveway. My mom's here. I gotta go. Still want a ride? Yeah. What are you gonna do? I don't know. I was thinking maybe I could spend the night at your house. Uh, that'd be totally cool, except my uncle's visiting and he's using the guest room. Oh, okay. Uh, what about your house? You know the first thing my mom's gonna do is call your mom. You're right. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just figure something else out. Are you sure you're gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Well, in case you wanna go back home, at least you only live a few blocks away. That's not even an option. I'm never going back there. All right. Well, call us if you need anything. Good luck. Bye. Hey, little girl. You lost or something? You want to come with us? Uh, no, I'm OK. Uh, do, do you guys know any cheap places to stay around here? There's a motel up the street. It's like 29 bucks a night. Come on. We'll take you there. That's all right. Thanks. Advice, never pull out cash around here. Please leave me alone. Don't worry, not here to hurt you. Hey, look at me. Oh my gosh, you're my age. So, what are you doing out here? It's my parents. They were driving me crazy, so I had to leave. I can understand that. How long you been out here? For about two weeks. Wow. I've been here two hours and I'm already struggling. When do you want to leave? I guess you could say for the same reason you left. You see, my parents were always being so mean and had all these rules. They never let me do anything made me feel like I was a prisoner. So that's when I decided to run away. I wrote them a note, grabbed my backpack, and took off in the middle of the night. At first, I was happy about my decision, but it didn't take long for things to start going wrong. Over time, everything got harder and harder. I ran out of money, had to sleep on the street, and I'm constantly surrounded by all these dangerous people. So you see, now I really regret my decision. Not a moment goes by where I don't think about going home. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. 
but if you don't want to be here, why don't you just go back home? I think about it all the time. Part of it is I live far away. Don't even have the $18 it cost me to go back home. The other part is I don't even know if my family wants me anymore. Hey, hey, don't cry. All I can say is don't make the same mistake I did. I regret my decision so much. a good mood this morning. Yeah. I just love you so much. Oh, honey. Oh, I love you too. Okay, go take a seat. I can't believe I fell asleep on the couch last night. Oh, you look so comfortable. I didn't want to wake mm. you. I'm surprised you're not on your cell phone. If you want to use it, it's okay. To be honest, I feel bad about yesterday. No, it's all right. I would rather just talk to you guys. Is this the same Sarah from yesterday? What changed? Let's just say I realized a few things. Well, on that note, I talked to your dad last night, and I realized something, too. I shouldn't have questioned you. It seemed like you really needed it, so here's the $40. Really? Mm-hmm. Actually, that's okay. Mom, I don't need it anymore. Well, well I've never seen you turn down money. <laughs> wow. Okay. I'm so proud of you, honey. Well, let's eat. Oh, yeah. Pass those waffles. <laughs> hey. What are you doing here? I came to give you this. What? But I thought you lost all your money. Yeah. But um, I returned something that I bought. I appreciate it, but I can't take your money. Oh, please, I insist so that you can go back home. Take it. Thanks. But I don't know. I'm a little bit nervous. What if my parents don't want me back? Are you kidding? Come on, they're your parents. Of course they do. There's not a second that goes by where they're not missing you, I'm sure. You really think so? Maybe you're right. Thank you so much. I'll never forget this. Come quick, Sasha's here. I missed you so much, Dad. Oh, wow, my baby girl. Look who's here. Look. Look. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Oh, my 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my baby. 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 Oh,
I'm going to be asking each person that comes in to get their dog groomed. Spare a dollar. I'm trying to get my dog groomed. And those who say they will give me a dollar, Darman Studios is going to pay for their dog to get groomed. Oh, you're getting jealous.